The content in this clip is not safe for wankers. <laughs> I know, I know, I'm running late again, Soz, my Yeah, Soz doesn't fucking cut it, dick brain. It's like your life's fucking purpose is to make me miss happy hour every night. Well, I'm trialling this new naturalistic morning uh, skincare routine. I didn't ask. It's a resin derived from the placentas of nomadic tribes people in the New Guinea Highlands. Yuck. And 10% of all proceeds goes to building them a new nutropathy hut. Get, get your fucking fetus cream out of my face. The point is you take forever. You're worse than none. Nan's, Nan's dead, Coco. Not our Nan, my other Nan. You know, slow Nan. <laughs> Nicknaming someone slow Nan is a bit of an ageist stereotype. No, it's not because she was fucking old. It's because she was in a fucking wheelchair with brain damage, dickhead. Coco, that's terrible. <laughs> yeah, no. <laughs> I shouldn't <laughs> laugh. <laughs> <laughs> huh? who's, who's the naked guy? Oh, 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 what guy? <laughs> Coco, don't mess with me. Oh, There's clearly a naked guy in the back of the van. I think you're a bit cooked, mate. <laughs> There's no one there. Hey, you've been hitting that fancy rich people drug too hard again, have you? <laughs> you, you mean my insulin? <laughs> yeah, whatever. I need that to live. <laughs> Don't we all, brother? <laughs> it's a serious medical condition. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> and just like people who say they take Ritalin for ADHD. <laughs> Bullshit! <laughs> uh, uh, Coco, your naked friend's climbing out the window. I told you, mate. There's nobody in... Oh, fuck! Quick! Grab him! Don't let him escape! Ha! Huh, I knew you were lying! Yeah, shut up! Just pull him back in the van before we both get done for fucking manslaughter. Manslaughter? This this is in, this is ridiculous! Oh, fucking hell. People are so politically correct these days. I, 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 I can't even have a naked guy in the back of my van without it being ridiculous. Fuck off. Just tell me what the hell is going on here, Coco. Uh. Obviously, I've peer pressured my mate into taking a shit ton of fucking acid, and then he realised the fabric of his clothing stopped him vibrating on the same fucking frequency of the world, and I had to chase him down a few suburbs with my van. Oh. Happy? Well, why didn't you just say that in the first place? I panicked, all right? You, you know how embarrassing it is for me, Mr. Perfect, to ask for help. I, I gotta, gotta make shit up. I once told Centrelink that I had an anal fissure as a way to get out of doing job interviews. Ew. Look, Coco, I, I, I'm your friend, Bloody your cousin, great. and I'd like to think spiritual mentor. mentor. I'm, I'm always here for you. Oh, last time I opened up to you about my childhood friend who died of the fucking leukaemia. <sighs> yeah, sad. Yeah, you, you spend the next 20 minutes talking about your greatest experience with grief as a kid. I was trying to relate. Which was the time you saw Littlefoot's fucking mum die. The, the land before time changed me forever, Coco. I, I was just trying to help by sharing my own personal grief story. You didn't even ask me what my mate's name was. <laughs> I still cry every time I see tree stars. Oh, fuck, not this again. Uh, I'm sorry. Well, what, what can I do to help this time, Coco? Oh, Oh, fucking like um, a hundred, um, hundred bucks would probably help the situation, I reckon. One hundred dollars? Yeah. <laughs> How is that gonna help? Well, he's fucking addicted to acid now, isn't he? So, the hundred bucks could pay for the rehab in, in Bali. Yeah, right. It's super affordable over there. They even throw in a free bentang singlet. And what's, what's the name of this, uh, rehab centre in Bali? Oh, okay, it's, it's the fucking number. It's a Bali, Bali, Bali fucking... Fucking, fucking drugs and, uh, uh, fucking, fucking, okay, fine! I just wanted a hundred bucks, all right? Are you fucking happy now? I told you. I, I need to make shit up to get help. Hey, it's okay, Coco, here you go. Yoink! <laughs> fucking played you like a fiddle, mate. <laughs> what? No, I, I just, I, I gave it to you, willingly. Ah, <laughs> that's what you thought, mate. I just inceptioned the shit out of you. <laughs> Mind blown. <laughs> <laughs> right, okay. Look, you can tell your friend to put his clothes back on now, Coco. <laughs> no, nah, he, he's not my mate. What? Then who is he? Uh, well, he's just some guy I'm out of the pub. I promised him a pineapple if he went along with it. Did you ask him to be naked? No, nah, just freestyled that bit. Mmm, yes. I like the way that the sweat feels on my bum skin. Ew. You promised me pineapple. Where is my pineapple? <laughs>